Well, one of the big claims today made by a former president, Jacob Zuma, while giving his testimony, was against the former Minister of Mineral Resources, Nkwako Ramatlori. He said in his testimony that Ramatlori had been a spy for the apartheid government and that he had been recruited in Lesotho as a young man. Well, Nkwako Ramatlori, the former minister, is on the line to us now. Mr. Ramatlori, good evening to you. Thank you for your time tonight. What's your reaction to this claim by the former president? No, I'm hearing lots of people touching lots of things. But um, let me say this. We died as children for the liberation of this country. We did not bear our parents. How would I on earth fell out when I could not even bury my father? You are I don't know if you understand what I'm saying. I do understand, sir. You, yeah? you are saying that it's simply not true. How, how would I fell out even I could not even bury my father? Are now, you... Please continue. Now, now, now. Uh, I'm sure your audience are listening. The storyline is the following. Some of us made big mistakes like the President Zuma did. And when we expose their sins, they come back to it. At all. Now, I, I'm not fighting with President Zuma. I'm not going to. I'm not. I'm a child. I'm not even child. But the bottom line is the following. I want him, I want to put him under a light test and me and their like before the commission so that we can prove what we have got technology now which can test if we are lying or not. So I want to put him under that light test before the commission. And I am ready to go there. Can I ask, Mr. Ramatlodi, why do you believe that former President Zuma has made this claim? Is there some other agenda at play here? I don't know. We must ask him why he made the claim. Are you going to take any action against him for making this claim? There might well be grounds for a defamation. No, no, no not now. I've had a light test. I'm a lawyer. So we go and do the test. After which, then I can pursue my other whatever options. Do you believe, sir, that there might be a longer-term agenda here, that some sort of political message might be being sent, that other people might be implicated in the same way that you have been, that claims might be made against them as well? No. Uh, you know what? I'm not interested in this and that story. But what I am interested in is for me and him to undergo the light, the light test. It sounds, sir, if I may say, that, that this is quite an upsetting claim for you, that this is... You heard, you, you heard me. And normally, normally I'm not... Uh, I don't speak a lot, but I want President Zuma and me to undergo the light test. But in public, so that the public can see. And so may I ask, do you believe that the ANC, the African National Congress that you've belonged to for quite some time, might be damaged by this testimony that's emerged today and that might continue to emerge through the week? Well, <laughs> I've been around. I'm 63 years old. I joined the ANC at 70 years old. And then I'm going to have sold at uh, 27 or 28 years old. I mean, honestly, but I, I want to go through the test. Nguako Ramatlodi, sir, thank you for joining us here on The Full View tonight. I do appreciate the time. Nguako Ramatlodi is the former Minister of Mineral Resources. You heard his very strong denial there and his request, his challenge perhaps is a better phrase, that uh, former President Jacob Zuma take a public lie, lie detector test and repeat his claims that he made.